It's hard, feeling like a vertical My heart never seems to let you go But my friends say it gets better with time Just arrived at Shimokitazawa and here it is. I'm gonna head to a cafe to get some coffee, but today I'm shooting a day of portraits, so I'm taking you guys along and I hope this is the way. But I'm waiting for Nao. I'm gonna be shooting with Nao today because she was the first one to contact. I contacted her when I came to Tokyo and it'll be a good idea to start this episode with her and we'll go around Shimokitazawa, which is like a district that's <laughs> there's a baby crying yeah it's well known for vintage clothing and it has a good vibe so we're gonna capture some portraits here and then head to Shibuya for sunset so I just found this super sick place it's like an open field where there's like pretty good background as well but like there's trucks that are like loaded with like food and drinks and you can get some like coffee which I did here and it's really nice actually because you don't have to really like worry about uh, having a mask on like the whole time because there's literally no one here uh, within like five even ten, ten meters so yeah um, I'll post a map for you guys if you want to check this place out Hi. so since we're already here we decided to shoot at this area with uh, three concrete pipes and some vintage car and leaves and those fairy lights. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> <laughs> We just finished shooting the cafe. Hey. Hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> um, and we're gonna just shoot around the streets, so yeah. just finished shooting Shimokitazawa. We didn't get too much because the clouds started kicking in at around 3 and it's currently 3 and so we didn't get too much but hopefully in Shibuya we get more photos and video there so we're gonna head there right now. And just like that you can get a can of soup at a vending machine here in Tokyo. So it's pretty cool. If you're hungry, a soup will do you justice. So just arrived at Shibuya and we're headed to Paruko which is a department store. Hopefully we get some cool shots there. There's a really cool pop-up that's happening for three more days. Two or three more days. So we're gonna go there. But the sun's also dead around here as you can see. So hopefully Hopefully we'll get some cool night scenes, but other than that, yeah, that's about it. So I just made it to the rooftop. It's the building for Paruko. It's actually not the very top as you can see, but there's a bit of light hitting, so it might be okay, but I doubt it. It's not that great, honestly. So 
so the pop-up shop was not open they closed yesterday so unfortunately we're gonna make our way to Harajuku because that's where we shot for the first time and there has there's a lot of neons there so hopefully we get some neon shots there before we head there we're gonna shoot a few photos at the crossing because I haven't done that in a while so I'll see you guys there this random training gym and I didn't think much of it at first but surprisingly this turned out quite nice <laughs> Just wrapped up the shoot at this weird um, gym or studio or whatever the training gym I think. But um, we actually got a super cool neon, all this with like crystals. So yeah, it was a success coming all the way to Harajuku, and we're gonna end the shoot here. So yeah, make sure you check out Nal's Instagram. Cold. <laughs> yeah, it was also cold. So yeah, but it was so uh, cold. it was a good shoot. So yeah, stay safe, stay curious, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. <laughs>